What happens when you blend an SUV with a hot rod? Well, Hark Designs has the answer. The American team crafted this marvel of engineering called Rock Rat. They merged the body of a 1947 Jeep Willys with a diesel engine from a school bus, resulting in the Rock Rat, boasting an impressive 700 horsepower. Complementing this power is Hawk Design's killer post-apocalyptic style, complete with massive 1.1-meter pitbull tires. Small features like a gear shift lever made from a fire trunk pump handle and a ram skull on the steering wheel add the finishing touches to this unique ride. Atlas often gets compared to Sherp, sparking internet debates about which all-terrain vehicle reigns supreme. Let's dive into the current version of Atlas and its features. It can accommodate up to 12 people, reaches speeds of up to 60 km per hour, and can swim at 7 km per hour. Atlas has a fuel consumption rate of 4 litres per hour, so the makers offer a 100-litre tank with the option for upgrades. A nice touch is its conventional steering wheel for control, rather than levers. Plus, it's capable of carrying loads of up to one and a half tons. The Bombardier Global 5000 performs admirably straight from the factory. The first model in service set a record for business jets, flying from Chicago to Paris in just 7 hours and 15 minutes. Plus, depending on the configuration, it can accommodate up to 16 passengers. Sounds impressive, right? But why not take it up a notch? That's precisely what the VIP completions team does. Whether you need a mobile office or a cozy space to watch a movie and catch some sleep, these experts will turn your wishes into reality. They're not just about repainting and interior work, they're also equipped to upgrade the avionics. The Kalman King is a very interesting off-road vehicle. It was designed in China, but it's made in Italy. It looks tough on the outside, but inside it's luxurious and offers features that can impress any buyer. Whether it's a PlayStation console or bulletproof armor, if you have the money, why not? When orders for the Kalman King started in 2019, buyers were offered a coffee machine, a minibar, and satellite TV as standard. For the engine, the Chinese chose the Ford V10 with 398 horsepower, keeping things simple. Depending on the setup, it can reach speeds of up to 220 km per hour. It takes about 15 months to hand assemble a Kalman King, which probably explains the price of $3.8 million. Many sources have called it the world's most expensive off road vehicle. Maybe it's wiser to spend that money on several cars, like the Rolls-Royce Cullinan, for example. Brabus, the German company known for their work on cars, also deal with boats. Seven years ago, they teamed up with Axopar boats from Finland to form Brabus Marine and focus on the aquatic side of things. Since then, they've been crafting beauties like the Shadow 500. The Cabin Black Ops Limited Edition boasts a 500 horsepower engine, allowing it to reach speeds of up to 93 kilometers per hour. It's perfect for a group outing, with room for nine people on board. Plus, the boat's premium feel is enhanced by the fact that it's hand-assembled and painted. Of course, this level of craftsmanship comes with a price. The 2022 Shadow 500 costs $299,000. At DD Designs, they have a knack for giving their custom bikes striking names like Rocket, Panzer, Sombra, and Blackjack. 
their latest creation, the Harley Davidson V Rod Muscle, is now dubbed Demon. Let's take a look. The standout feature might be the wheels, especially the rear ones, sporting a 360mm Monster V tire. Up front, there's a 200mm Metzler tire. Additionally, the bike boasts a Vance and Heinz Competition Series exhaust with ceramic coating, custom mirrors, and a leather and suede seat tailored to perfection. And to top it off, it's coated in denim black paint for a sleek finish. Let's talk about Brabus again. This time, they're unveiling the Rocket 1000, their most powerful custom vehicle yet. Sharp-eyed viewers have already figured out that the 1000 in the name stands for its horsepower. That means that this car can go from 0 to 100 in just 2.6 seconds, with a top speed of 316 km per hour. Originally, it was a hybrid Mercedes-AMG GT63 SE performance. Brabus had worked on this model before, but they only managed to squeeze out 930 horsepower. Now, they've increased the internal combustion engine's volume from 4 to 4.5 litres and installed more powerful turbochargers. However, the electric part of the Mercedes remains unchanged, providing 204 horsepower. Evolve Skateboards lives up to its name by pushing the boundaries of skateboard evolution. Take Renegade, for instance. Need to zip along at 42 km per hour? This board delivers. It's crafted with a carbon fiber deck, though it's a bit hefty at around 16 kg. But fear not, it can go up to 50 km on a full charge, and its wheels are ready for off-road action on gravel and dirt. Controlling 6 kilowatts of power in skateboard form, it's probably both exhilarating and nerve-wracking. You can give it a shot if you've got $2,500 burning a hole in your pocket. Can you imagine what the road boss would look like? Maybe you pictured something like this. Or this. Interestingly, the latter is just an AI creation, but the real road boss was conceived and built by humans. Allow me to introduce you to the road boss. Yes, that's its actual name. It's a vehicle with 10 wheels, three Chevrolet V8 engines, and an articulated frame. It's based on the white road boss 2 truck from the White Motor Company. Though it's a bit odd that the creators went with orange, what really matters here is its sheer size. This monster stretches a whopping 12.4 meters and weighs no less than 15 tons. Needless to say, for the driver of this monster, the term traffic jam probably doesn't even register. Let's consider something more compact and maneuverable. A Can-Am trike might be just what you need. On the screen, we have the Spider RT, which the company claims is the pinnacle of luxury touring. With features like adaptive seats, cruise control, and excellent wind protection, the makers have ensured that once you hop on the trike, you won't want to get off. And when it comes to dynamics, everything's top-notch. The 2022 Spider RT Sea to Sky version showcased on the screen comes with a Rotax engine delivering 115 horsepower and a six speed semi automatic transmission. A full tank can take you up to 406 kilometers, and in parking lots, the advanced safety system keeps your trike secure. It won't start without the driver using a coded electronic key. As for the price, you're looking at around $42,000. Light Horse promises to take you on a journey of sustainability and excitement. And it's more than just a catchy slogan. Firstly, it runs on electricity. 
Secondly, it can reach speeds of up to 65 km per hour, which is quite thrilling, along with its four-wheel drive. You ride it standing up, but what exactly is it? According to its creators, it's an electric ATV. It offers three power reserve options – 40, 60, and 80 km – and you can add on accessories like cup holders, a rear cargo rack, and a winch. But be prepared to spend a hefty sum. The basic light horse starts at $24,000. The Nora 500 is a brief yet highly enjoyable rally held in Mexico. Spanning just two days, it covers a total distance of 500 miles, equivalent to 805 kilometers. Unlike the longer Mexican 1000 rally, the Nora 500 offers a simpler format, enabling riders to not only showcase their skills, but also appreciate the warm hospitality of the locals. Lynx isn't resting either, and has already unveiled their 2025 model year snowmobiles. There's plenty to admire in each of them. The Brutal RE boasts a turbocharged engine with 180 horsepower, ensuring confident rides even in deep snowdrifts. The Rave model, with its retro-inspired design, pays homage to the legendary Lynx GLS 3300 while matching the same horsepower. Then there's the Shredder, known for its exceptional maneuverability thanks to the lightweight Radian Squared platform. Depending on the configuration, it weighs from 204 to 216 kilograms. Interestingly, the Shredder is priced lower than the Rave and the Brutal Re, starting at $17,949. From Detroit with love, meet the Bollinger B1. If you're a fan of the Tesla Cybertruck's design, the B1 might catch your eye too. This electric SUV aims for simplicity and practicality, skipping the luxuries found in fancier models. However, it does offer adjustable ground clearance ranging from 250 to 500 millimeters and can tackle hills with a 52 degree angle. There are also different layout options available. The top version boasts two engines with a total of 626 horsepower and a speed of up to 160 km per hour. Unfortunately, the makers have decided to discontinue the B1, shifting their focus to commercial trucks. The B1's hefty price tag of around $125,000 likely played a significant role in its fate. The Kamaz Master teams have clinched victory at the Dakar Rally a remarkable 19 times, marking the best performance in national and brand standings among trucks. Whenever Kamaz trucks show up at other rallies, it's enough to make the competition nervous. But what makes these trucks so formidable? Let's take a closer look. Meet the Kamaz 43509K, introduced in 2015. It boasts a powerful 12.5-litre engine, generating 1,030 horsepower. Besides, its unique hood layout distributes more weight to the rear axle, improving performance in sand and ensuring smoother landings after jumps. Thanks to its shifted center of mass, the Kamaz 43509K handles winding routes with ease. Completing today's lineup is the team at Carlex Design. Take a look at what they've turned a 1986 BMW 6 Series Coupe into. Presenting the BMW 635 CLX Limited Edition, the first model of Carlex's collection of seven classic BMWs. They focus mainly on the interior, adding specially aged leather and an Alcantara upholstery. Handcrafted dashboard details elevate the luxury. 
The Blaupunkt Bremen SQR46DAB stereo may look like a cassette player, but it actually supports Bluetooth and hides a USB connector. While the engine specs aren't specified on the site, it retains its original power of either 182 or 215 horsepower. However, the suspension is updated for a sportier yet still comfortable ride. The car likes design team values their craftsmanship at around $138,000.